YouTube, this is XXXMan360 here. Today I am doing a tutorial for a game that I haven't reviewed in a while. I'm going to show you how you can edit the default materials, skybox, and studs in Roblox in a very easy manner. First thing you're going to do is go to the description of this video and download the Roblox platform content editor. Next, you're going to open it up. As you can see, it's made by me because uh, I'm a cool guy. We are going to export a texture so we can edit it. So we'll select option 1. It's going to ask for a Roblox version hash. To find the hash, simply find a Roblox client on your desktop, right click hit properties, and in target location you'll find the hash. It is the information right after version dash. Copy that and paste it right into the window. Now we can choose a texture and it'll export it right from the client. I'm going to edit the grass. So we see it puts the grass texture on our desktop. And I'm going to edit it how I want. I've edited the grass texture and now I'm ready to update in the client. So I will choose option 2 and then put in the hash like I did earlier. We are going to select grass, and now we must drag the file diffuse.png into the terminal window. Then we press enter. It's going to ask if we want to make a backup of the grass, and I'm not going to because I prefer this grass over the default one. So now it has updated the grass texture, and I'm going to open up Roblox so you can see what that looks like. As we can see, the glass, the grass looks completely different, which means that it worked. Now let's do something a bit more fun, like changing the skybox. So as before, we choose option 1 and enter the hash, and now we are going to choose sky. So now it has placed, instead of a single file, it is placed a folder called RBLX Sky. When we open it, we see all the different sky images that Roblox uses. So we can edit them from there. And if you want to find a place to find good sky boxes, I recommend custommapmakers.org slash skyboxes.php. The link for that will be down in the description. Anyways, I have edited the sky boxes and I have saved them all. Now we'll go back to our program over here, and we will choose option 2, and we'll enter the hash. And then we will choose the sky, and now it's going to ask us to drag the folder RBLX sky into this window, and press enter. We press enter. Uh, I do not want to make a back of the sky because the default one gets boring after a while. Now we will go open Roblox to check it out. This is what the sky looks like with the grass. Now you have to say it looks pretty nice. The last thing I want to show you how to do is edit the studs. And this one is just like editing the materials. We will choose option 1 and put in the hash and then we'll select studs now it's on our desktop we can edit it and I'm just going to do something simple now I have saved it I'm going to open the program and choose option 2 and enter the hash and then select studs I'm going to drag the studs image into the terminal, press enter, and uh, I, I'll make a backup because that was sort of a lazy edit. Alright, so now it has updated that, and let's go to a game with studs like Crossroads. This is how you edit the Roblox surface textures really easily. And if you found this helpful, please leave a like on the video, and subscribe for more videos as it helps me out and let you know when I upload a video.
Thanks for watching, and goodbye.